you've seen the show Landscapers Challenge on HGTV. It's where families submit their homes for a complete makeover of their yard. Well, one Valley family was chosen along with a local landscaper. Suzanne Bissett has a look in tonight's home style. Suzanne. That's right, Patty. In the past couple of weeks, we've gone along with the Sharapo family here in Chandler as their front yard goes through the ultimate transformation. They're counting on our designers to come up with a yard where everyone's comfortable. Next on Landscapers Challenge. It's one of the most popular shows on HGTV and apparently also in the Serapo household. We're big HGTV fans and uh, Landscapers Challenge specifically. We actually TiVo it every night. That's our dirty little secret. And that's the dirty little secret that convinced Steve and Jill Serapo to take a chance and enter their Chandler front yard or the lack thereof. There was quite a few entries and what they ended up doing was picking the landscapers and sending a bunch of the films. We had to do a 30 minute home video showing us and our kids and our family you know in our home and they sent them to the landscapers and actually let the landscapers choose who they wanted and chris ford with artesian landscaping in phoenix picked the Sharapos, signing on for the project of his life we do have a schedule and then it is very very tight in fact we're worried about getting it done in time a little stressful it's very stressful we're going to be gearing up with a lot more personnel and so what's in store for this landscapers challenge they really wanted the courtyard. That was the main focus of their front yard. They wanted an entertainment area out front. There's going to be a big fireplace out here. And that's exactly what Chris's team went to work on. Starting in August, plans were drawn. Mounds of dirt were moved and the transformation was underway. August 28th, crews were busy pouring concrete for the front patio and placing every driveway stone in its perfect place. September 8th, the driveway is almost finished, but it's the front courtyard that still has a long way to go. September 18th, lush greenery arrives, and this house is starting to look more like a home. On September 26th, HGTV is soon to arrive for the final filming, so time is ticking. This size project's about a three-month project. And you have to do it in a month? All right, so after weeks of blood, sweat, and tears, how did it turn out? Well, oh, not so quick. Coming up in an hour, Patty, we're going to have the reveal and wait till you see it. Artesian Landscaping did an absolutely incredible job. You saw the before. Wait till you see the after. I can't wait. When? At 540. Oh, you didn't say. Oh, yeah, in an hour, my usual time, 540. Okay. Be Thank here. You. I will. Thank you very much, Suzanne. Hi everyone, I'm Suzanne Bassett and tonight's Homestyle, we're here at the Sharapo household in Chandler and their home has just undergone a huge transformation, all thanks to HGTV's Landscapers Challenge. And after weeks of working against the clock, it's time for the big reveal. We have a month, not quite a month to finish this project and we haven't really even started. That was Chris Ford back in August when he chose the Sharapo family's home and their dirt lot for HGTV's Landscapers Challenge. At times were you thinking, oh, I don't know if I'm going to get this done by the time the HGTV crew gets here. We were definitely in that position. In fact, the day before our filming, uh, we worked late to get the project completed. Well, that big day has finally arrived, and it's time for the big reveal. You know, you get a picture, and you get the diagrams, and they do a little painting of the house, and you can visualize it, but you have, you're never quite sure what it's really going to turn out like, and it turned out way better than we ever could have expected it to. Artesian landscaping not only transformed their landscape, but the outside of their home. Well, one of the main things was the drainage. The first time I was at this project, I walked on a plank to the front door. That pond is now replaced with a beautiful courtyard with a fountain and a fireplace where the family can sit back and relax. The courtyard is phenomenal because we could play with the kids in the courtyard. We shut the gate. They can't get it open. The dogs can be out there with us. A dusty driveway is now a yellow brick road, and a dirt yard is a desert oasis. So after this seven-week labor of love, was it all worth it? It was a long road, but finally done, it looks great. It's actually better 
than we had dreamed it was going to be. We just made little decisions along the way and it turned out great. Does it feel like you live in an entirely new home, yeah. but your address is still the same? <laughs> yeah, it's a little scary. You know, we pull up, we're, ooh, is that our house? And, you know, we sit out in the courtyard in the mornings and we feel like we're at a resort. And I think after tonight, I'm going to have a hard time leaving their resort. Look at their courtyard with a fountain, the candles, the fireplace. So what was the budget for HGTV's Landscapers Challenge? Well, it was $65,000, and the Sharapos went a little over that. But working with Artesian Landscaping, they said it was all worth it. They couldn't be happier. And as you can see, their daughters, <sighs> Sloan and Shay, <laughs> right? How are you guys doing? <laughs> Yeah. And what do you want to say to Patty? Hi, Patty. <laughs> Hi, honey. <laughs> they love it. They're having a great time, and it's just been an incredible experience, they said. And you can check out the show on HGTV. It's going to be sometime early next year it will air. That's more than just a little over $65,000. <laughs> I swear, I was thinking more like $150,000. No, it was job. not that much. They really? did go over their budget, but it was it was under 100. That's wow. Yeah. Uh, but again, awesome they also job. did what they Beautiful. in artisan landscaping not only did the landscaping, they did what they call a hardscape. So if you remember the before, I mean they really changed the whole look of this house into a Tuscan field. So they did the mm. Landscape and the hardscape, and of course, those were that's where the dollars come in. That's what I mean. <laughs> Thanks, Sus. You know, I was beautiful thinking, job. I was just thinking about bragging on my kitchen work, but not after ah! seeing that. That's awesome, you wasn't bring, it? You got to bring in your pictures. Okay, I will. But I love the circular drives too. Uh, and that beautiful yeah. brickwork. Yeah. They did an awesome yeah. job. That's nice. That was very nice. Hundred fifty. Uh, <laughs> pretty nice weather At today. Least.